Let's talk a bit about cell comments in Excel. As we saw in a previous chapter, we can add comments to any cell in our worksheet. Comments are used to make notes inside a cell about its contents, things that other people might need to know, but without directly typing it in a cell. You know, I can always type a note here in a cell, and that's no problem, but if I start to fill out my worksheet with a whole bunch of notes right here, for starters, it's going to look messy, and also, people aren't going to be able to tell necessarily what I'm referring to. So, for example, if I type here, system load is strange, what system load am I talking about? I mean, I have a bunch of values here, I have several values outlined in yellow, so you really don't know what I'm talking about. So, in this case, the best thing is to add a comment. How do I add a comment to a cell? Well, I click the cell. That I want to add it to and I go to the, to the review tab right here and inside the review tab I click here which says new comment and now I can type in my comment right here and now every time that someone opens the worksheet they're gonna see that there's a comment via this little red indicator that's on the corner of the cell and if they step over the cell the comment is going to show up now we can also make this comment display in a permanent form For example if I right click here I can click here where it says show hide comments and the comment will show permanently so if I know that someone is very likely to miss this little red mark I can simply leave the comment here displayed permanently and then after they read it they can simply hide the comment like that. An interesting thing I can do with comments is I can copy and paste them from one cell to the other. For example, if I have a lot of cells that require the same comment, I don't have to type the comment in inside all the cells. Simply I type it in one and then copy and paste the comment. We're going to see how that's done. For starters, I'm going to add a comment to this cell right here. New comment and I'm typing this load is usually high for the time of day. Okay, and here's my comment. Now I want to take this comment and paste it in all these other cells. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click the cell that I'm taking the comment from and I'm going to copy the cell as I would normally here in the Home tab. But instead of pasting in a regular form I'm going to use the paste special command and I'm going to select all the cells where I want my comment to end up then I drop down paste and I select paste special and right here in the paste special menu I click comments and OK and with that the comment has been copied to all the cells as you can see right here and now everyone can see exactly why I outlined this cell in yellow and they can figure out what to do about it when they look at the worksheet. If I want to remove a comment it's as simple as clicking the cells, right clicking and inside the right click menu I select delete comment just like that. Now, what if I want to find comments inside a worksheet? One thing that happens often is that you make comments inside your worksheet while you're working on it, but finally when it's time to ship out the worksheet, you don't want those comments to show up. You know, if you're making a bid on a certain project, you might have uh, added a comment here which says this margin is way too low, we need to make it higher. Someone corrected it, and when you're sending it out to the client, you don't want that comment to show up. So how do you find if there's comments inside your worksheet? Well, what you do is you open your worksheet and you go to the review menu and you can use these two buttons here, previous and next, to move along the comments. See, here's one, here's another, here's another, here's another, another. And Excel will just go finding and finding all the comments that you have. And you can decide what to do with each one. You can also click here which says show all comments and Excel will display all the comments in the worksheet. Personally I find it much easier when you're looking for comments to simply use this previous and next because you jump directly to the next comment. 
Whereas if you show all the comments, you might eventually miss a comment that's down here at the very end of the worksheet. So that's how you work comments in Excel. That's uh, what you do with them, and that's how you copy and paste them in your worksheet. Thanks for watching this video tutorial. If you liked the video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and to visit our website, cubicleoverlords.com, for more instructional videos like this one.